Hello and welcome everybody to our YouTube channel. My name is High Thumb. It's a high and a thumb, and it sounds like what it looks like. I'm a lead Microsoft Office trainer, and I have three tips for you today from working from home. Our first tip for today is to learn a keyboard shortcut that will allow us to organize our desktop in the easiest way possible. And I mean by the applications that I have open on here. You see, I have Excel, Outlook, Word, and I would like to work with two applications and create a split screen although I don't have another screen. You probably do it by hovering over the borders and adjusting the width and the height of any application manually. Let me show you how to do it with the keyboard shortcut. I'll go ahead and select Excel. And I would like to have a, a split screen between Excel and Word. Excel on the left-hand side and Word on the right-hand side so I can work on both at the same time. And then I'll go ahead and use the keyboard shortcut Windows left arrow key to snap it to the left. And by the way, you can use any arrow key in any direction you would like to snap that window. And then on the right hand side, I will go ahead and choose Word. Go ahead and give that a try. If you can't do great things, do small things in a great way. So let's go ahead and do a small thing in a great way, which is taking a screenshot of this one and then pasting it in one note. Now we all know that you can use the snipping tool to do that, but let me show you the easiest way possible to go ahead and get a screenshot of any part of our screen, especially if we're in a meeting, we're taking notes, and somebody's sharing their screen and we want that content. So I will go ahead and use the keyboard shortcut, Windows Shift S, and that activates the snipping tool. You see my screen is grayed out, and then I'll go ahead and draw a screenshot around this awesome quote, and now it's copied to the clipboard, go into OneNote, and paste it and there it is next tip for you is copying text from picture with one note uh, if i go ahead and right click on any picture i can copy text from picture and then i can go ahead and paste it what go ahead and give that a try so you can go ahead and add in your own notes happy face